Hello, Harry Leppard here at the Effective Learning Centre. Our aim is to improve your English every day. So today I wanted to talk about stating your opinion or saying your opinion. Here we have three sentences. I think that, in my opinion, and I'd like to say. They all mean more or less the same thing. All they are is a way of telling someone you are going to say your opinion. It's a way of hedging, a way of making your opinion more polite. So, for example, when you say, I think that, you say your opinion afterwards. And when you say, in my opinion, and I'd like to say, you say your opinion afterwards as well. So it makes it more polite instead of just saying, politics is stressful or working is hard. So just imagine standing there, complete silence. No one says a thing and someone says, I like tomatoes. That would be quite unusual. So it's better to say, I think that tomatoes are great. In my opinion, tomatoes are healthy. I'd like to say that tomatoes are an important part of your diet. So it makes the sentence sound better. I'd also like to say, see, I'd also like to say that I think that is polite, but I'd like to say is more polite. So this is polite, this is more polite, and this is the most polite. I'd like to say that I'd like to say is more polite than in my opinion. In my opinion sounds like you are going to say something to counter an argument. This would be more common in an argument. This is more common in a general opinion. And this is frequent in most topics. So I want you to notice that in this sentence, there is no verb, but it does not matter. This has the same meaning, more or less, as sentence one and sentence three. I'd like to finish with saying that sentence two, in my opinion, is quite formal. Sentence one, I think that, is quite informal and you can say it in any situation and sentence three I'd like to say is quite polite. I hope that helped. See you next time. Goodbye.